The Russo-Ukrainian war has been going on for some weeks now, with the Russians making progress in the north towards the Ukrainian capital. Down south, the Russian general Vlanta Isov Takovich has been given orders to push his assault finally after weeks of shelling, bombing and skirmishes. The Ukrainian army have been holding steadfast and will now be put to the test. Major General Joseph Frederick of the 54th Mechanized Brigade is aware of the Russian troop movement reported back by the Reconnaissance Cavalry Battalion. He orders the Cavalry Battalion to stay fixed until the Russians officially cross the river. The 3rd Mechanized Battalion to reconsolidate Vivitsik, the Armour Battalion to move closer to the 2nd Mechanized Battalion, the 1st and 2nd Self-Propelled Artillery to rearrange the front of Vivitsik, Russian Major General Mikorin Zinin of the 119th Mechanized plans his assault with other local brigades, the 28th Air and the 75th Armour. The 2nd Mechanized will attack Vivitsik with support by Joint 1st Attack Hilo of the 28th which will make their way over by sea. The 1st Mechanized will attack or push back the 54th Recon Cavalry past Lingos River. The Recon Battalion will attempt to stall any intervention by the Ukrainian 2nd Mechanized, supported by the 75th's 1st Armored Battalion if necessary. The Battle of Vivitsik takes place with heavy Ukrainian defense. Ukrainians have been under constant shelling for several days now. The second mechanized infantry used light scouting to observe any changes in the Ukrainian position. The Ukrainians relay the Ford scouts, but the Russian BTRs follow their scouts swiftly behind. The first wave of BTRs are planned to stay behind the river to provide fire support. Because of the heavily entrenched positions, the Ukrainians have time to take aim shots at the vehicles. First attack healers do quick flyovers, but are met with Ukrainian RPGs. The second wave crosses the river transporting assault infantry, but not many make it across.
the fighting continues for the rest of the day. Eventually the Russian forces disengage with the Ukrainian. But maintaining a solid fighting force, they are opposed to strike again when necessary. The 3rd Mechanized Battalion reconsolidated at Vivisic 